We'll guide you through how to recover your Roblox account without your email or phone number. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. So you have forgotten your password, so you've gone and clicked on forgot password or username, but then it's going to ask you either for your email to reset your password or your phone number. You may have not added either of these or you don't have access to them. If that's the case, then all you need to do is scroll right to the bottom of the page and you need to go and click on help like so. Then you'll be taken to the help page. Here you need to go and type in forgot password like so, and you'll see this article here, I forgot my password. So it's gonna go and guide you through resetting your password using your email and then your phone. So you can read through this, but of course, if you haven't got either of them, it isn't that much use. So then you can come down to still having trouble. And it says, if you didn't add an email address or phone number to your account and tried to reset your password, you can't reset your password with this feature. So contact customer support describing your logging issue in detail. All players must verify ownership of an account before it can be reset or any information changed. So you can click contact support. You need to go and enter in your date of birth. You can then click on continue. And then what you need to do is go and fill out the contact information here. Enter in your username, your first name, your email, and you need to confirm it. And for the issue details, you can then go and choose the device you're using. And you can then select account hacked or can't log in. And for this one, you can then say forgot password. Now fill in the description of issue and describe that you can't go and sign in and you don't have access to your email or phone number or they aren't added to your account. Within this process, Robux are going to ask you to go and verify ownership. That's super key. So for example, if you purchase something on your, the account, you may need to provide a receipt or proof of you paying for it or something on the lines of that. But that's it, guys. If you found this useful, then leave a like.